too, because uh, <laughs> I, that the top appeared to be see-through. Well, maybe she's trying to uh, get extra points with the judges. Worked for me. Back I'm in round judging, three. Though. That, would, that wouldn't be good. Round three. I think my wife wouldn't uh, appreciate it since... No, but I would volunteer to videotape the beating she'd give you. Yeah. Yes, that would be a quick submission. <laughs> Both These fighters guys appear are to have got another wind. Yep. Right, it's a third Still or fourth exchanging. wind. <laughs> and they are going for it. But what a slugfest. Certainly some great exchanges during this fight. Ebersaw using those knees. Didn't appear if any of those connected. Uh, oh, and Brett returns the favor. Nice knee to the chest. Yeah, both these guys are very tired right now. But game, neither one willing to uh, give Watch it up. closely, though. I mean, this is you can see how cold it is. Look at their breath. Yeah, look at my breath. Uh, I don't want to look at your breath. <laughs> See, but theirs is like a foggy white. Yours is green. Can I get you a beer, Mike? Yeah, I, I need another beer. <laughs> Actually, I need uh, something warm. Perhaps a shot. A light exchange there. Yeah, both guys are very fatigued here. Brian walking forward, throwing blows, pressing the action there. Certainly might be using up the last of what he has, though. This is the last round. It's, uh, well, how do you call it? Who, do you, who would you give this to? I would say uh, at this point... Oh, nice trip takedown. That's pretty tough. I would have to say uh, Ebersol right now, but not by much. Only because of his uh, aggressiveness. He has come out in the last two rounds and drove forward with uh, a flurry of punches and the takedowns as well. And, uh, you know, Brett's been defending himself against the takedown pretty well, but uh, but Ebersol's been getting them. So I, I would say Ebersol right now. Uh, I wouldn't like to call it. I'm not sure. I, I think it's very, very equal. Both fighters have... Uh well, that's what I said. It'd be very, yeah. very close. I, I, you know what? I don't think I'm going to go out on a limb. <clears throat> I think it depends on the judges. No, 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 no. It's not. You know, Paul Smith says that best. Uh, just don't leave it up to the judges. The judges just are three people that have the best seats in the house, but they shouldn't make decisions on the fights. Fighters need to do that. Well, they better get busy. You were still working in uh, Bergmark's close guard. Herb taking a close look at this. They may be getting close to a stand up. It's interesting how uh, Ebersol is moving around to keep them pointed towards the center of the ring as opposed to under the ropes. Well, he is on top. And. Uh, I think he can relax a little more down here. Getting some nice shots in. And Herb standing him up. Yep. Back to the center of the ring and they'll be restarted on their feet. Oh, very nice right there. Didn't seem to affect uh, Bergmark though. No, the angry hick has a tough chin. Angry hick. Yeah, that's his uh, nickname. Although I don't know why he's uh, maybe the way he fights, but he is just truly a nice individual. Oh, nice oh, and out of, out the, of the, ring. the ring. He's a nice, uh, well-mannered country boy. Yes, he is. I saw him prior to the event. You know, he's sporting a cowboy hat and the whole works. You know, Good so guy, much. tremendous heart. I mean, these athletes tonight, it's amazing. They've, they've all just worked very hard. 
Showing a lot of heart. Yeah, there it is. Apparently I was wrong. The judges will be deciding this fight, which is a shame. Well, you know, you always would like the fighters to be able to, but a lot of times you get equally matched uh, fighters in there. They're giving their all, but uh, knockout's not always possible or a submission. Well, they're going to have to figure it out. There, and and there they are, Paul Smith, uh, commissioner of the IFC, going over the uh, judges' cards. And one of the editors of Ultimate Athlete Magazine, Tracy Ratzloff there. Lifestyle editor. Ladies and gentlemen, the judges have made their decision. It is a split decision. The winner, Brad Split decision. Oh, and of course, my prediction as well. Just goes to show you. Wow, what a slugfest. You never know. Both fighters tired. That was a great fight. For tonight, super fight was provided by Good job by you as well. I mean, uh, you put this fight together. Great matchup. Very much for sponsoring our well, it goes down to the fighters. These guys are just fighting their hearts out. Well, now he's the uh, the happy hick. <laughs> 